Well, here we are again. It's uh, Friday afternoon. I've got the afternoon off work. Uh, unfortunately, we've got a busy weekend, haven't we? So we don't have much time, but we'll try to do what we can. I'm going to make a start today. My job is to try to take the bathroom radiator off, but uh, Linda accidentally broke, pulled that carpet off from behind it. On purpose. I know. So, um, yeah, I've got to drain the water system as uh, much as I can, take the radiator off, then we can prepare behind it. So that's going to be a bit fiddly, but it needs doing. And uh, you're doing the... I will be putting the undercoat on the ceiling in the actual shower. Then I will work round you and get the undercoat on the walls and the ceiling. I'd love to get all the undercoat on the bathroom walls so, today. So, so we'll see how it goes. So when we're not here, actually Linda's took the doors home, haven't you? Some of the doors to paint. So our kitchen's full of uh, smelly painted bits of wood. Um, but hey, that's the way to get on. So we're going to get to work. Have a cup of tea because it's so cold. Got the fire on again. And uh, oh, we'll see what we can do this afternoon. Okay? Cheers. Linda's in position with a lovely uh, hat today and, and the addition a... of a head yeah, torch. Lovely. So what I'm going to do down here is uh, there don't seem to be a drain screw anywhere. This radiator's got to come off, so I need to undo these one way or another. So I'll have to drain the water through those. So I think what I'm going to do is sort of put a little system like this to catch the water, uh, put a little so it's a little roller tray, and hopefully you loosen the water. Uh, sorry, loosen the bolt. Watch the water come into there, and all will go perfect. What could go wrong? Hmm. Well, I've loosened the, the, uh, the nut off the radiator, and as you can see, I was a bit concerned about the job. They don't like plumbing, um, but as you can see, my idea is working quite well. It's slowly just draining into a little um, plastic bowl down here, coming out nicely, slowly draining away. No mess, no nothing, work perfectly. Fingers crossed it stays like this. Excellent news. Right, yeah. sugar. Okay, it's Linda getting some paint. Is this undercoat or it's not primer anymore, is it just undercoat? This is undercoat. I've done primer. So scalp here, well do me tap. Have a little look. Oh yeah. I think. That's not bad, it's so much lighter, isn't it? I mean that wood. I know it was fashionable and all that sometime here. Put your light over there so we can just see the back. Oh, look at that. That is so much nicer. I'm nodding my head like a donkey. <laughs> <laughs> you are strange. And, uh, I married you, didn't I? That's true. So here we go. Um, there's a bit of. I've got to fix the mushroom above this vent, which I've just dropped down temporarily, because there's a bit of staining around there, there wasn't a bit of, uh, bit of damp. You expect that. The, and the, the surveyor told you to seal the mushroom there. Yeah, they're not very good, are they? Yeah. So anyway, so there we are. So that's coming on well. Right, let's go back down to my little job. And uh, One little problem. I'm doing nothing here, just watching. Oh good, can you go get me my little brush? Please. Okay, one moment, let's just check that's alright. Okay, excellent. Well, that seems like quite a success. Brown horrible water. I thought you'd have antifreeze in this system. I think it's supposed to be 40% antifreeze. I have to check that, and I've disconnected this side now. No more water coming out, so it's just a matter of undoing the other side. I haven't made a mess so far. I haven't spilt anything, so I should have that radiator off uh, shortly and be able to get to that carpet behind. So that is quite good news. Okay, so now I'm going to put my fingers under the end of the radiator because it's going to empty out if I try and get it off, and hopefully lift the thing straight up with no effort. And oops, um, I have a radiator off. Yay! So, as you can see, it's not too much mess. I've caught most of the water in the plastic containers, there wasn't that much in the radiator. Uh, not surprising, we've got a leak. I just got to take those um, radiator mounts off, move the pipes out of the way, and we can get that bit of a bathroom done. That's really good news. That was all I was hoping to do today, and I've done that in good time. Excellent. Right. How are you getting on, Linda? I have completed the painting of the undercoat in here. That looks and nice. As you've done that, I suggest you go and seal the mushrooms. Um, I'll pull the carpet off first. How about that? Oh, okay. That's <laughs> well, at least you can do something while I'm up on the top. Um, okay. I'll try and get that done. I think you're right. I am now going to pull off the revolting green carpet. 
Yippee! What's it like behind? Oh. There. I can't pull the bottom. No, you've got the pipes. Be careful. Just right. to look. Okay, I'll pull the pipes and have a look. This stuff comes off. That doesn't look too bad, does it? Right, I'll get that pipe stuff out and we'll have a little look. But that ain't too bad. Next job is reseal these mushrooms. The screws are so hard to take out. I put all my weight on this screwdriver and push down. Oh god, that one's coming. These are leaking badly. Will that be enough? <laughs> Turn it around. Yuck. That's a nice spider though. So as you can see, it's a bit of a mess. Really I need to do that all properly, rub it down, do the paint work. Just for now I'm going to give it a quick rub, put some sealant on and put it back and that'll have to do it for now. Right, I've got one of them off and the screws are really tricky and I've got two out of this one uh, here and I'm going to try giving them a bang with a hammer just to dislodge the threads. It works with motorbikes and mechanical stuff, so we'll see. Otherwise, I'll have to put a bit of WD-40 or something. We'll see. Right, and it's started raining. Let's get up here. And, uh, come on. No, nope, I'll have to do them another day. Oh. Well, I've done that mushroom. That one, I've got two of the screws out, or I'll lose them two, I can't do them. And I might go onto that, onto that third one. But it's just starting to rain and getting dark. I might have to leave that for the weekend. It's raining, it's cold. I can't get the other mushrooms off. I've tried, but it's getting really cold. It's starting to get dark as well. So I think for an afternoon, done pretty well. Quite just what we've done, got the rad off. A um, little bit of finishing off inside, that'll do us for today. Hi Linda, how have you done today? Well, as you can see, I've painted or undercoated the whole of the bathroom. Yeah. Including the bits behind the radiator that there was a green carpet and there's no longer a green it looks, carpet. It looks good, I'll have a look at me, but you've painted your hands pretty well. I know, it's the most awkward place to paint in. There ain't much room in there, is there? Anyway, no. should we have a little look? You may go have a look. Okay, let's have a little look. Uh, oops. Be careful. I am being very, very wet. Oh, wow. That takes 16 to 24 hours to dry that bit. That looks so much better. Look where that radiator was. I'm going to put the radiator back on there. It's going to look really, it's so light compared to what it was. You can't really see on the film because obviously it's a small little room. But um, oh, that's going to look really nice when it's done, tidied up. Looks lovely. Excellent. Let's have to see if I can see in the shower, but oh. be careful. Okay, I'll leave that. Well, Linda, that's an excellent job. Of course. Uh, well done. My pleasure, darling. Well, we're back home, and as I said, here we are in the kitchen. Here's some of Linda's handiwork. It's drying. It looks quite nice now. That's the uh, cupboard doors from the bathroom, was it? Yes. Where we were, where you were doing? So you could. Toast. Correct. I bought them home on Monday. I was going to do them on the boat, but it was absolutely freezing, and I thought, hmm, nobody here to put the fire on. I'll uh, take them home with me. So I unscrewed them and brought them home. Excellent. And voila! Excellent. They look really good. So we need a top coat on those tomorrow, I think, isn't it, or whenever? So that would be quite nice. Top coat anytime now. Okay. Right. Well, that's it. That's our video for today. Um, we've done a fair bit of work, didn't we? Most certainly, you did a lot of chatting to the marina chat, but... Yeah, well, well, you were painting and you wouldn't talk to me. Right, so we got a lot done today. 
I'm quite pleased with what we got done. It wasn't like a vast amount, but it was about fiddly jobs. I mean, the paint's got to dry. I had to get the radiator off. That's annoying. So we did a lot of stuff. So I'm really pleased. Anyway, if you like what we're doing, you're enjoying this, please don't forget, can you like the video and su press subscribe? It doesn't cost you anything, but it helps our channel. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.